The pimp said, you can't make any money having a baby in the oven. We have got to kill this baby. They kicked her in her stomach. They fed her alcohol. They gave her drugs. They took a hanger and stabbed the baby over and over again. But the baby would not die. The baby was born two months premature with no pancreas, a learning disability, a bladder too small, unable to function, a severe stutterer. We call it a trick baby. Nobody wants the baby. No hope, no future. Kill it was the word. That baby was me. I'm the lowest of the low. I come from the guttermost. I come from a hellish condition. And so when I would go to school, I couldn't talk. I stuttered so severely from the trauma. My mother had a madam who hated men. Her name was Dolores, and she was a sadist. And when she would watch me, she would take a broomstick and stick it in a place where no boy should have any object in his body. And when you are tortured like that, you learn four things. Don't talk. Don't trust. Don't feel and pretend nothing is happening. And by age 10, I had had enough. I want it to die. And in my school, they put me in a boiler room with other kids who were dysfunctional like me, where we would finger paint all day long. And yet there was a teacher, thank God for her, who had a Gideon Bible. And she came to my school, and she saw kids like me as her mission field. And she would give me this Gideon Bible and read to me stories of dysfunctional characters who God used. She would say to me, Ronaldo, God uses greatly those who have been wounded very deeply. He will turn your pain into power, your wounds into wisdom. She had me read the story of Moses, who was also a stutterer. I began to understand that God did love a trick baby, even as low as I was. There was hope for me and possibility. And when a child begins to understand the love of God and the power of his word and the possibilities, it changes everything. How can a young man keep Keep his way clean by taking heed according to your word. Your word have I hid in my heart that I may not sin against thee. I began to memorize the Bible, that Gideon Bible, reading 2,000 scriptures. And when you put that kind of word in a life, something begins to happen. My stuttering went away. I stopped wetting the bed. I stood tall. I became valedictorian, became a pastor, and preached until everybody in my family got saved. Why? Because somebody placed a Gideon Bible in a woman's hand that changed a life forever. Yes! I was born a trick baby, but the trick was on the 